people, Makaya here, back with another video. If you're new, welcome. If you've been around for a while, welcome back. Either way, let's just take this day by day. I want to start off this updated weight gain journey video with a weigh-in. So let's go to the scale. So this morning, the scale told me that I was 118.4 pounds. On Saturday, it told me I was 119.4 pounds. So bouncing back and forth consistently between 118 and 119. Very proud of that. It took me a while to get past the 110 plateau. It took me a while to get past the 115 plateau. And now that I'm at, you know, almost 120, I feel as though 125 is obtainable. I feel as though it's realistic. And I've decided to bump up my regimen a little bit. These babies are going up in price. I'm still purchasing it though because it works for me. But yeah, it's getting a little expensive. And I've heard a lot of great things about creatine as far as what it does. But I've never heard anyone talk about the taste. So when I tried this, I was completely caught off guard by how freaking salty creatine is. I, I don't know if I was expecting to not taste away, but it tastes away. <laughs> it says to mix one scoop with eight fluid ounces of water or other beverage. Thankfully, the first time I tried it, I had water, but water wasn't enough. So I took shots of Gatorade after each sip and it was a struggle. I said, I can't, if I wanna be consistent with creatine, I have to do something. So I looked all over the internet and Reddit told me, mix your creatine with your mask gainer. It'll mask the saltiness and um, you'll be able to enjoy it. So I'm like, hmm, okay. Tried that and it actually worked for me. The first time I put my water in, like I normally do, put my two heaping scoops of both 1340 in <laughs> and then I put a scoop of creatine I'll show you all what the scoop looks like it's very small um, also gonna admit the first time I tried it I tried to do it like people do like pre-workout not it um, but yes it's a little just a little just a little little spoon and uh, ooh. Oh, don't do that. It doesn't, it doesn't smell like anything to me. <laughs> Jesus. But that's what it looks like. So, okay, first time, boom, put the water in, boom, put the mask in, boom, put the creatine in, one scoop, done. Mixed it in the blender, perfect. But it didn't mask it enough. So I switched up the order, put my three scoops of water, do one heaping scoop of my mask gainer, put the creatine in, and then more mask gainer, so it's mixed up in the middle, and that worked out. So this will be a daily thing for me. Um, it also says to consume ample amounts of water taking this product. I wasn't set on this one, like I didn't go into GNC when I was buying my bulk 1340 and say, I want this creatine. I just, I talked to, the employee about it. I was like, oh, I have seen this one around. Seems like it's doing well. There was another one he talked about. I said, I'll go with this one just to give it a go. Um, so we're on day four of taking this. I will give you all progress, you know, photos eventually. But there's this one photo I posted up on TikTok. I posted this picture. And your girl just got done a good old leg day. The pump was pumping, okay? Like, my butt, the booty, insane. I, I said, is that me? <laughs> so the gains are coming through and I'm very excited about it. The leg day, let me run it through for y'all because I didn't record anything. Or run it down, run it, you know, run it somehow. Explain it to y'all. I got in the gym, I went straight to the stationary bikes. I'll do five minutes on there 
make sure my RPMs are good, heart rate is up. I try to get my heart rate to be at least like 160, 170. If I'm chilling, maybe like 150, but it has to be up there so I can get a good workout in. For me, like as an athlete, I, I, need, I need to be like, <laughs> I went to the free weight section and I did reverse lunges along with single leg RDLs. So it was like, boom, reverse lunge, single leg, single leg, reverse lunge. I think I did three sets of that. And then I went over to the machines. I think I just did leg presses. Wow, yeah. But I was going so slow through my workout, it felt like I did more. Um, but I was just honestly taking my time feeling the workout, you know, and everything that I was doing. I stayed for, it was probably a 45 minute workout, not gonna lie to you. Low, low reps, multiple sets, heavy weight. And yeah, I went to the, to the locker room, took my flick, cooled down and left. I was thinking about doing sprints. I know a lot of the girls that I follow on TikTok fitness wise have been finishing off their leg days with sprints, but I was cool with getting back on the stationary bike and then yeah, I did. So right now I'm still kind of sore, like, these shorts aren't the most flattering, <laughs> but I'm sore in like this, <laughs> this area. <laughs> it does feel better today. That workout was on Monday. I might go back and do calves. We'll see how I'm feeling. Definitely have to clock into work right now. Um, I know I don't look work ready, but don't come for me. I work from home. Only have one meeting today and that's at three o'clock. So I have plenty of time to, you know, get presentable for that. Um, but if you all have any questions about the Bulk 1340 or the creatine that I'm taking, um, feel free to let me know. Also open to suggestions, recommendations. We're in this together now. So <laughs> I will see you all in the next video. Bye.